And welcome back, this is Baller Scuba with another StarCraft II commentary. As you can see here, I am the blue Terran in the southwest, failing at a pro split there, uh, up against VT Steezy, uh, the red Terran in the northeast. Uh, this is my first placement match. Uh, I am officially out of the practice league. Uh, this is on uh, Blistering Sands, as you can see, there's rocks blocking the back door, but nothing blocking the front door. I am going once again for the uh, MMM build, as uh, it has done me pretty well so far. I'll uh, continue to go with it until somebody forces me to do somebody el something else at this point. Uh, looks like uh, nothing too strange going on at the beginning of the, uh, of the match here. Uh, VT Stevie is going uh, tr uh, 9 Supply Depot, as am I. Uh, just uh, SCV hanging out there. He really should be uh, getting a barracks as soon as possible. There he goes. Uh, but then he stopped training uh, SCVs. Looks like uh, he ran out of minerals there. I am also just hanging out my SCV there. Uh, and finally getting that barracks. So VT Steve Z uh, outperforming me at the beginning of the match here. Uh, we'll see how that changes over the course of the game. It looks like he is putting the barracks in the middle of his base, not blocking off the ramp. It's not really something you need to do against the Terran, uh, but I like to do it uh, just for practice, if, if nothing else. I am sending a scout out. Uh, this is the first time I've been able to do that uh, because this is the first time it's not been a novice map. Uh, checking out the Zelnaga Tower doesn't really help me at all. I am going towards his base here. He is not sending a scout out. Instead, he is going for a bunker. Uh, going to fill up that bunker. It looks like full of marines. Uh, he does get a refinery up. Uh, still has two SCVs queued up, so he's not going to be getting an orbital command anytime soon. Uh, then again, neither am I. Alright, so my SCV does go into his base. It does see that bunker. Um, I don't know what I'm doing here. Uh, pretty much abandoning that SCV. Uh, letting him die there. Uh, not building any infantry force, even though I did see that bunker. I assume that he's going to be turtling up, not making a quick offensive move. So I'm not that concerned, so I go straight for the tech lab instead of the reactor. The reactor would give me marines early on, but I don't feel like I need that because I did see that bunker. Steve's still not uh, scouting my base. Uh, putting down another bunker. Looks like he's going to fill up more... Uh, with more marines, but he did sidelock himself, so he is putting down that supply depot. Um, he's got a bad rally point there. He should really be putting that on his minerals. He can take somebody off if needed, uh, but he is getting an engineering bay, as am I. Uh, still pretty similar builds at this point. Uh, I am beating him slightly on harvesters, plus I have a mule out with that orbital command. Uh, he is now just getting that orbital command. Uh, really just going for the bunker strategy at this point, but usually when you see early bunkers, you see them somewhere near my base <laughs> attacking my buildings. But really this is just for defense at this point of his own base. Um, I also am slightly paranoid. <laughs> Since this is my first placement match, I don't know who I have come up against. So I do put down a bunker. Uh, getting the stim pack, which is so important towards the for the infantry units there. What else am I doing? Uh, not keeping track of my orbital command. That's not what I'm doing. Uh, need to get SCVs all the time. Pump SCVs constantly, but luckily for me, he's not really doing that either. Allowing me to take a 16 to 20 to 16. Uh, Harvester lead as he's uh, putting the rally point straight to the refinery. Um, 
I'm really not that micro intensive when it comes to my uh, command center. I just put it right onto the minerals and let them deal with it. If I want somebody to go to the refinery, I'll take somebody off minerals. Uh, if I need to build, just like you saw there, I'll take the SCV off and go build wherever I think I need to build. Uh, this is actually a really bad placement of supply depot. You want it on the other side of this tall grass. I'm not sure what that's supposed to be called. Uh, you want to see if these rocks are being uh, destroyed, and I can't see it from there because of that tall grass. I do finish loading up my bunker. Uh, just the one. Um, Stevesy's uh, got two bunkers out, oh, and he put down a sensor tower, which is arguably the most useless building in the game. Um, sure, it can tell you what units are moving around where, but it can't detect, uh, and really that's what I want it to be able to do. Uh, if Blizzard wanted to fix that, that'd be great. Put a little detection on there so I can see ghosts. Uh, banshees, that would be awesome, and I might build it on purpose sometime. Factory going down for Stevesy. Um, I'm just going as many barracks as I can. Uh, not even uh, a factory going down for me yet. I do have the Weapons upgrade number one for the infantry getting number two along the way. He is getting the factory. I do have my four racks up. Uh, pretty late in the game for uh, four racks though. Uh, let's speed up a little bit here. Try to keep it under 15 minutes. Last one I tried to upload didn't quite make it. So let's try to speed this up. Don't want you guys to have to suffer through uh, two videos if I don't have to. There we go. I got a little block of supply depots. None of them in a very useful spot, but they're just supply depots, anyways. So if he wanted to, he could have come up this ramp and completely wiped me out. Uh, this is why I'm still a noob. And I don't know that much better, but I do have pretty good saturation here. Uh, not keeping track of my mules and my SCV production, as I should. I do have uh, quite a big lead on him, but he is expanding now. Uh, he does send his marauders down here to protect. Um, I am sending my infantry out. Uh, going, Thinking about putting a, a, a second command center there, um, but I just don't have enough minerals as I'm constantly producing the marines and marauders he does scan he does does he see my four racks he does uh, so he is uh, what's he doing he's getting another barracks to retaliate what he should be doing is producing more siege tanks siege tanks are great against my infantry right now um, they only got one one I don't believe I go any higher than that. I do need an armory to go higher than that. And uh, but finally getting a tech lab on my starport. Uh, wondering if he's going to go for a ravens or banshees or um, something else to counter uh, my infantry. But when I come over here and I see that uh, really he doesn't have a, a huge income coming in right now. Um, because, as you can see, I still have the Harvest Elite. I do let that SCV go. Uh, I'm not too worried about it, to be honest with you. I know there's not m much else where he can go. Um, and I doubt he has a ton of minerals waiting to just build a new command center. He does put it at the high yield, uh, but those blocks, are, the, those rocks are blocking his way in. I can speak, I swear. I do have my backup army here in case um, he does try to retaliate in some way that I can't see. Um, I'm just content right now with these guys holding out, uh, making sure that he doesn't attack with a large force out the main gate. Um, I do have that tech lab. I'm not sure. Um, there we go. Um, medevac going across. Um, hoping to, to heal these guys up. I really shouldn't have sent them out until